Hi guys, this is the Saturday, the beginner for August, June 22nd, 2013. East Coast Sway. We started with a basic triple, triple letter out, rock, step, triple, triple, rock, step, letter by, triple, rock, step, basic, and the guys go, triple, triple, rock, step, another basic. Then we had ladies, guys, rock, step, basic, and then we brought it back in so we can restart. Triple, triple, rock, step. So basic of East Coast Swing. Side to the other side. So we are facing her. Rock, step, triple step. Gentlemen, your right hand is going to slide from her fingertips down her back. Triple step, rock, step as we end up uh, facing each other in the opposite direction. Realizing that the first set of triples is assigned to the other side and we're changing places. So the leader goes to his left, I go to my right. So at the end of the first triple, triple step, we're pretty much past each other. Ladies, if you will leave your arm where it is, as he slides his hand across your back, you'll find it at your elbow. Let him follow the elbow down to the hand, and then you'll be ready for your rock step. From here, we did a basic, triple, triple, and the gentleman, we identified our right hand, and we did side together, side over, and as we face her, our arm is going to be hitting, or, yeah, I guess it's hitting, Julie's right arm, and we will find her fingers at the end as we do our second set of triples and a rock step. If you look at it from the back, you'll see how that works. Rock, step, triple step. Dom releases my hand. As he continues to turn to face me, if I leave my hand right there, it will travel across his lower back, it will strike his elbow, and I slide down to the bottom of his hand. So there's no need to release and reset or look for the hand. It's right there at the end of his arm. Amazing, isn't that? And gentlemen, we did rock, step, triple, triple, Rock step. From here we did another basic. One and two, three and four. And we led a he, she turn. Or she, he turn. Rock step. Triple step. Gentlemen, we are hopefully stopping her a little bit with our hand on her back. We have this nice window. It's not over Julie's head. It's over our head. And we go underneath. Triple step. Looking for her. So again. It was a rock step. Triple step, guys go under, triple step, rock step. Ladies, your job is to be aware that his hand on your back means you need to stop and not move away from him. Rock step, 
triple stop, the hand on the back, plus my hand stretching over to his head tells me that's as far in that direction as I should go. On the second triple, while he's going under his arm, I'm rotating 45, 90 degrees to face him. Triple step, rock step. Gentlemen, especially Mike, since you're so tall, we had a rock step, triple step. Now, Mike, since you're really, really tall and your partner was really, really short, short I said put it on your shoulder, so as you turned around, triple step, you could face it. This also works, gentlemen. If you're not comfortable with here, you can also end up going to your waist. Rock, step, triple step, leave it low. Triple step, rock, step. From here, gentlemen, we get a side, uh, we let her by again, this time we caught her. Rock, step, triple step. My hand's on Julie's back, and I go back a little bit. Triple step, rock, step. From a different angle. Rock, step. I'm letting Julie go by. Triple step. My hand is on her shoulder. I capture her. Triple step. Now, gentlemen, I also said sometimes if you're also very, very tall, if she is very, very tall, to go for her back of her waist and then lift it up so she doesn't end up uh, having her elbow caught on you. From here, we did a rock step and we started all over again with the face. So, ladies, all of these feel as if you're doing the same pattern until after the first triple. So, always on the first triple, I'm turning 90 degrees, stepping side together, side, and then depending on the pattern, I'll be facing him most of the time, and um, he'll be doing whatever he's doing, which varies depending on the pattern. And that was it for beginner. We will see you guys in two weeks. We'll see you in two weeks. Bye. Go Blackhawks.